Hello everyone. Normally we see on television adults and serious athletes who've dedicated their whole lives to training. We all know what to expect from them, and their numbers are unbelievable. But what about younger athletes? They also deserve our attention because sometimes they do absolutely incredible things that even adults can't do. Especially for you, we've brought together the best young athletes in the world. You ready to meet them? Then let's get it on. Bunchy Young Maxwell Bunchy Young plays American football, exercises a lot, and at his young age received a full athletic scholarship at the University of Illinois. Surely you're thinking, ah, oh, good for him, without understanding what's so special about it. But we must clarify that Bunchy is only 11 years old. He started training when he was only four years old, and since then he's achieved amazing results. Although the boy had his first serious sporting experience as a track and field athlete, his heart is devoted to American football. Come on, let's go. Because teamwork is important to him, and he doesn't like to compete with his peers. In the future, Bunchy plans to play in the NFL, participate in the Olympic Games, and one day become a mayor. And it's not just a fantasy. Thanks to his years of training and constant exercising, the kid has understood that reaching any goal is just a matter of hard work, and Bunchy is ready to do it. Maxim Reznichenko at what age should you start raising a true champion? Even before he was born, Maxim Reznichenko's parents knew their son would be an athlete, and at the age of a year and a half, he began to master skis. Today, Maxim is only five years old, but the list of his hobbies seems impressive even if he was an adult. Judge for yourself. The boy practices BMX and motocross, knows how to ride a quad, a snowmobile, a hoverboard, a jet ski, and skates. He also runs, often takes part in races, does gymnastics, climbs, practices trial and parkour, swims and jumps on a trampoline. And it seems that Maxim enjoys all these activities. According to the little athlete's father, his son's favorite sport is the one he hasn't been able to practice for a long time. For the rest, the boy has not yet decided who he wants to be. But let's be honest, he still has a lot of time. He himself says that when he grows up, he'll become a superhero and save the world. And by judging the determination of this little champion, he will succeed. B-Girl Terror Terror was born in 2007 and began to practice breakdance when she was two and a half years old, although the girl could already stand on her head when she was a year and a half old, and all because her older sister, B-Girl, Eddie, was already dancing, and this really inspired the little girl. But the real recognition came to Terror after performing at the Shells Battle Pro 2013, where she surprised the audience with her incredible dance moves for a six-year-old girl. And it's really amazing. Terra seems to control her body so well that she can do any dance. In part, this is true. Terra herself says she handles different styles and likes them all. Today, the girl is a member of the breakdance group Soul Mavericks. Terra trains every day, and even at her young age, she's already thinking about the future. I see myself growing up as a dancing mermaid and go all over the world and explore things and make everybody happy. Great plan. Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. When you are the son of a world-famous football player, five times winner of the Golden Ball, it is quite difficult to develop a sports career, as your achievements will be compared to those of your father. But it seems that Cristiano Jr. is not afraid of this. Not only does he plan to become a football player, but he also wants to outdo his father. You must admit that this is not an easy task, but already at the age of eight, little Cristiano is moving quite confidently towards his goal and scores incredible goals for his age. Vamos, Chris. For example, at the age of seven, he became the school team's top scorer, so he received a cup and a statuette. More recently, Cristiano Jr. began training with Juventus Youth Academy, which is part of the club where his father currently plays. And while the boy participates in team training for children under nine, he definitely has a great future. Ezra Freck 
In Ezra's life, difficulties began at an early age. Due to a congenital anomaly, doctors had to amputate the child's leg when he was only 11 months old, and also sew his big toe into his left hand, because Ezra only had one finger there. It sounds terrible, and most people in Ezra's place probably wouldn't have even thought about playing sports, but this boy is just amazing. Ezra says that sometimes it hurts him to notice other kids looking at him and talking about him, but he also knows that he can do everything a kid his age can do if he tries hard enough. After all, more than anything, Ezra loves to play sports. He plays football, basketball, and enjoys athletics. Skateboarding and surfing are also among his hobbies. According to Ezra, when he plays sports, he doesn't feel any different from the others, and he's really happy. Of course, sometimes the boy has to work harder than his peers to achieve his goals, but the effort and time spent give results, because as Ezra says, without sport, he would not be himself. Baby James when you think of the favorite activities of a three-year-old, most likely you imagine some sort of playing with cubes or riding a tricycle. But what do you think of uh, golf? Yes, at the age of three, little James astonished everyone with his talent as a golfer and continues to do so today. How's your game today? Good. The most amazing thing is that his only coach is his mother. It is she who takes James to the golf course at least four times a week and supports her son in everything. But not just because she's decided to turn her son into a champion. The boy himself shows a great interest in golf. There you go. Even when baby James couldn't walk, but was only crawling, he was already trying to roll the ball which was placed in front of him. At the age of seven, the boy had a really impressive track record. At his age, James had won the US Kids Golf Tour 16 times and managed to win the hearts of many golf lovers. Today, James is eight years old and looks like he has every chance of becoming the new Tiger Woods. What do you think? Say hi to everyone out there. Hi. Evnika Sardvakas. You think boxing isn't for girls? Try explaining that to Evnika Sardvakas, a girl from the Kazakh city of Pavlodar. Since the age of five, the girl has been trained by her father, who's developed his own training methodology, in which sparring is completely omitted. But this doesn't seem to bother Evnika at all. She attacks with an incredible speed for her age. The girl has developed phenomenal reflexes. Evnika believes that there is no one in the world like her in speed, so she prefers to compete with herself. For example, timing her punches. Her last result was 358 blows in half a minute, which is one and a half times more than the previous result. And the girl continues practicing because she is sure that success is in regular training. However, in addition to boxing, Evnika has other hobbies. She loves to dance and does that regularly after training with her brothers and sisters. After all, the girl's family are all athletes. The girl's father is a former boxer, and her sister, who trains using the same methodology as Evnika, at the age of 15 became a bronze medalist at the World Kung Fu Championship, fighting against adults. Connor McLean. Connor McLean is a true star of gymnastics in the United States of America. Today, she is 13 years old, but Connor began practicing gymnastics at the age of three. In addition, her mother, Lorinda McLean, says her daughter became interested in the sport when she was 18 months old, maintaining balance without help. Later, Connor began working with coach Susan Brown, who helped the girl discover her talent. It's hard to believe that the girl can do all these tricks when she's only 13, but she has a great future. In addition, both the coach and Connor's mother are unanimous in assuring that the girl motivates herself, setting goals and reaching them with confidence, despite all the difficulties. Well, we wish her good luck. Jaliah Manuel 
Jelia is eight years old, lives in New Orleans, and has more than 120,000 subscribers on Instagram. That the girl attracts the attention of the internet audience not with beautiful images of food or something similar. Jelia is an incredibly talented young basketball player, and what she can do with the ball is really incredible. The athlete borrowed many elements and exercises from Stephen Curry, who is considered one of the best dribblers, not only in the NBA, but around the world. The girl is so interested in basketball that she doesn't stop practicing, even on holidays such as Christmas. She says vacations are not an excuse to stop training. Jelia's dream is to play in the NBA, and we think the girl has every chance of doing so, because she takes her hobby very seriously. In addition, her love for sports, combined with her talent, has led Jelia to develop her own exercises, which other coaches use to train adult athletes. Psst, dude, are you looking for new technologies and great gadgets? Are your thoughts focused on the future? Do you love huge vehicles and can't imagine your life without robots around you? Then visit TechZone and you'll find all this and more. The link is in the description. You interested? Great.